Well, hello again. I just wanted to show you this. What I noticed. This. Man, so. <laughs> this is bad. And, and, and this should have been fixed today. Before anybody gets killed. But that just shows what kind of a crack hole this is. Now I'm looking. I'm trying to see where there's tire marks. And it looks like. That's tire marks there. And there's a set parallel. You can see it right here. Right here. Let's see if I can follow them. Right here. Look at this. Right here. This is how bad this area is. See, when, when I'm able to walk right here, Look at this. Right here. Coming along right here. Man, what the heck did this? There's some guy's fender. Oh, yeah, look at that. And these people will run you right down. See all these dirty bastards? They'll run you right over. And that's what I put up with it in, the, in this area. So that's the car. Toyota. I can't even make that out. Camry LE D94 NTE. Like the, uh, <laughs> that looks like uh, either this car got sideswiped, either this car got sideswiped. And you could start seeing that track just leading right there. How the heck these things are facing in this direction is beyond me. Crime night. <laughs> and last night I thought I heard, oh man, what the heck's going on out there? I thought I heard something. So, update. That spot over there that I was at earlier today. Uh, those little... Man, you got to be so careful. This place is crazy. Pieces of headlight. I don't see anything up here. Uh, just walking around here, you take your life in your hands. For, for more than one reason. If you think there's 27 hit and runs in this area, right in this area, 27 hit and runs a year. So, uh, when I was down at the uh, uh, little boat launch over there earlier, uh, I said, oh, there's two, two guys over there fishing. Well, if they were fishing for those snapper bluefish that I've been talking about. I'm not particularly interested in them, but they beat a blank. So, the tackle I went down there with, they chewed up that little white uh, jig. I glued it all back together. That's why I don't like playing with them bluefish. They're like saltwater piranhas. And, and for what tackle costs today and lures... For, for those fish, it's not it's not worth it. It's just not worth it. Uh, maybe tomorrow I'll uh, come back down here 
and see what's going on. So there are fish biting. And I heard a bunch of fairy stories from them two guys. Oh, yeah, you got to come here during the spring and, oh, they get the big stripers in here. I don't see anybody down here in the spring, and I'm down here quite a bit. So, pizzeria was closed, which was yesterday. I'll go down to that, or the day before, right? The, uh, go down to the pizzeria. That was closed. So, I walked all the way back and made myself something to eat. And today, I'll see if he's open. So, today is the 5th. My eyes are so shot, I can't even see the things on my wristwatch. Today's the 5th. So, that's what the United States is, is one big vacation, one big holiday. Everybody, oh, we're on vacation. We just got back from the weekend. Oh, yeah. And, and the people, well, the, the workers, the people I know that work, um, they, they work hard. My uh, friend, uh, Tom, in Somerset, uh, he puts in a lot of hours. Anybody else I know in this area, and I, what, what do I know? Doctors? That's it. And I, I to, just to go for them for treatment. And most of these people have, I don't know, I'm figuring two, three day work weeks, and that's it. So that's what's happening with this country. Everybody's on vacation, every day is a holiday. You time your vacation with the holidays and you wind up with an extra who knows how many weeks that you don't have to work. So, anyway, real quick uh, update on that. Uh, so, and it's hot as hell and it stinks. Whew. Something died. Somebody's got something rotten in the garbage. Uh, I'll probably be going down, coming up here, whatever, with some lighter tackle and seeing if I couldn't, can't connect up with some. I had them tearing up that jig, but I only let it go so far. And then, you know, they're, they're not going to get that whole jig down their throat so I can set a hook on them. But my little pieces of metal that you see me throwing around there's no way for them not to get hooked with them if they even put that in their mouth they're hooked if they side swipe it they're hooked so maybe uh, tomorrow depending on how sore I am because that was a big walk today all the way down near to the boat ramp back back out back down to that other bridge I'm going right now to the pizzeria and uh, I'll stick my head around the corner over there and see if I see any uh, movement on the water Pee jeez stinks so yeah, that just shows how dangerous that is out there oh you lift I'm pretty sure that must be beautiful it sucks. It's a nightmare. Everybody here, whatever they're doing, is more important than what this, the, the uh, residents are doing. They can be walking down the street, they'll drive up on the damn sidewalk. Try and cross the street, you're lucky to get across. I've been lucky so far. So... Like I said, 27 hit and runs in this area. Oh, and uh, Somerset. Who was that? Uh, Tom Terrific. That's who I used to fish with. 
uh, in Somerset. Tom, uh, Franklin cop, uh, was just busted. That's on, uh, uh, New Jersey Exposed. He just put that up. I think he killed two people. Uh, drunk, uh, convertible. I don't believe, uh, anybody had any seatbelts on. I'll include the link that, uh, New Jersey Exposed, who is also Gunnison Undercover, Gun Gunnison Undercover on Facebook. John, John is, he's out there, man. He's doing his job. He's, uh, posting all of this stuff, digging all of these, uh, articles up that you wouldn't normally see. A lot of it gets covered up. When we go to their Facebook sites, they're not mentioning any of these uh, sexual assaults. They're not mentioning, you know, any of the uh, vehicular homicides caused by these cops. They're not mentioning it. And it's in their county. It's their cops. So we get on there and we'll put all the articles. We, we, we uh, cut and paste or whatever the heck they do. Whatever I do, I click and put it on there and then ask the question if they had intended to cover that up or is there any more information that they're going to release on that uh, case. You never hear back from them. Uh, check out a site called Delete Laws. I, 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 I'm sure before you even finish... Uh, typing it in, delete laws will come up. The guy's name is Chili. It's C H I L L I I, Chili. And a couple years ago, he was hot and heavy on the uh, accountability uh, stuff. And I guess he had to take a little break or something for whatever reasons. And uh, he's back now and telling you he's on fire it's doing real good so chili is out there he's uh dishing it out just like he gets it so they treat him like crap he gives it right back and he's he's a healthy boy too i haven't seen any of them uh cops he gets arrested but he's got lawyers so he sues him uh, i haven't seen any one of them cops take him up on the offer uh, to go on the wrestling match with him and, uh, you know, duke it out in, uh, on there without a badge and a gun to see how tough they are. Not one cop is taking him up. So, you'll see. Surely he looks like uh, uh, some kind of college wrestler. Uh, so, healthy boy. And get over there and look at his site. I'll, say, I'll, I'll try and remember to put uh, Chili's site in. And uh, I'll put another link in for New Jersey Exposed and Gunnerson Undercover. So, hit the thumbs up if you so desire. And uh, if I get my pizza and make it back home... I'll be talking to you again. Thank you so much. Thank you, thank you, thank you. And maybe, maybe, maybe I'll catch some fish tomorrow. And, uh, you know, just have that little bit of enjoyment. I get to do that, what, once a year. When I was fishing almost 365 days a year before this whole Trenton uh, debacle. I mean, I was fishing through the ice, everything. I was catching fish left and right. And, and being moved down here and then having declarations violate my civil rights and dump me. Declarations, Inc. and Freehold, New Jersey. You heard me say it plenty of times. They're still criminals. The guy that runs the place, he calls himself the owner. His name is James Marhold. I don't know if his doctor prefix is real. 
to Dr. James Marholt. I, 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 don't, I don't think it, that, that doctor means anything. Because he's a scumbag. For him to let his employees abuse a client the way they do, me, the way they did, the way they are, it's unconscionable. It shows what a scumbag he is and what a scumbag organization he runs. So, anyway, I'll get my pizza. Uh-huh, and it's hot out right now. I'll talk to you people later. Please hit the thumbs up. Bye-bye. Um,